Wonderworks is made possible by a grant from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting, with additional funding from this station and other public television stations, and the National Endowment for the Arts. Little girl's toys left behind So much there that she has yet to find Learning how far she's come Wants to hear a song? No, no, nobody. Con dinero y sin dinero. Oh, no. Siempre hago lo que quiero. Y mi palabra es la ley. Papi, can't we go any faster? We're going to be late. Samuel, por favor, cuidado. You're giving me a heart attack. Ricky, put the window up. My hair, it's going to get messed up. I don't care about your hair. Con dinero y sin dinero. You're going to Siempre hago lo que quiero. da 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 di da da di di Dios mío, who can afford a car like that? Maybe someone we know. After all, when a man gets promoted. Samuel de la Cruz. Jóvenes, you are looking at the new operations manager of King Wire Partitions. Good times ahead for the de la Cruz family. <laughs> All, right. All right, Daddy. Wow, if we drive a car like that, all the boys will think we're rich. Boys, ni que boys. You're too young to worry about boys. Congratulations, puppy. Thank you, Mika. Wipe off that lipstick. Da 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 She looks like my mother. She's beautiful. She's a real woman now. She's had her keen say. Well, that's the way it goes. At 14, you're still a baby. Then you turn 15, you have a keen say, and everything's changed. Few months would be dancing just like that. Only if the father says yes. Has he agreed to your king say yet? He will. We just haven't picked a date yet.
Silencio, por favor. Quiero hacer un brindis to Gabrielle on her 15th birthday. This is a day that a father can be proud of his daughter. And this is a day that his daughter can be proud of herself. To Gabby! Yeah. footwork. He kicks to Morales, and Morales, up, scores a goal. All right. <laughs> so, wait, did you see the soccer game? Nope. Oh, I see you were watching the Angels. The Dodgers, they got Venezuela. <laughs> out a dress, okay? Even if your dad agrees to the dance, who's gonna be your escort? I'll find somebody. Who is that? That's trouble. He's Gabby's cousin, Ramon. Oh, he is so cute. He just moved here from New York. He's staying with cousins. I hear he's pretty wild. Marta? ¿Cómo estás? Hi, Octavio. ¿Quieres bailar? Sure, I'll dance. You want to hold on to that? As a matter of fact, go ahead and eat it, right? Because all it needs is a pair of teeth. Oh, gracias. Octavio. That was very nice. Hey, a man's got to do what a man's got to do, right? Father dance with his little girl. Papi, all the other girls can dance with boys. Other girls don't have fathers who merengue like Valentino, mija. Stop. understand why he can't plant his roses in his own yard. Because he doesn't have a yard. <laughs> Boys, hijos, leave Jorge alone. Now go inside and change if you're going to act like salvajes. Jorge, you should have seen my friend Gabby's dress. It was dripping with lace, and she had this two-tone nail polish and these really, really high heels. <laughs> Jorge, here, we brought you some cake. Uh, in El Salvador, La quinceañera is for the rich. No las tenemos. Don't worry, Jorge. 
You can come to my quince. Yeah. If she has one. But everybody has one. Everybody has a mass. The party's extra. But the party's everything. Well, maybe if she behaves herself, huh? And her father wins the lottery. <laughs> Senor, do you know if you have worked for me at your factory? ¿Qué pasa? I thought things were going well. Uh, I've been in this country one year, and now they ask if I have paper to show I belong. So I know have job. Um, I'm making up some paquitos for supper tonight. I'll send some, huh? No, 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 señora. Yo todo bien. What's going on? Immigration up to their old tricks again? Migra, they don't let you rest. Don't worry, Jorge. A man like you should have no problem finding work. Aliviana, they lighten up. So glad to see everybody listens. Whose turn was it to do the dishes, huh? Ask Marta. Yeah, ask Marta. I have to iron my dress. Mm -hmm. And you left it on. Marta, this is not responsible. Now, come on. You want to be a grown-up? Huh? You better start acting like one. Ay, these newcomers with all their problems. Either they can't hold a job or they got immigration yanking them from their houses. Samuel, por favor. Kids from school disappear all the time. Once this kid borrowed my biology notes, I never got them back. Be very glad we don't have their problems. This family is American citizens. We put in our time, earned respect. That's the American dream. With hard work, anything's, anything's possible. possible. That's right. Must be the American side of you talking, Samuel. What's wrong with that? Papi, about my party. Aha, now she wants to talk about the Mexican side. Eddie. Ask your mother if she thinks we de la Cruces are too Americano to put on a splashy party like the Coreas. Papi? Get all dressed up. Quite a few hundred people. Everyone watching as the proud parents glide around the room. Papi? What are you waiting for? You got a party to plan. <laughs> ah, you're gonna make a beautiful quinceanera. Who's well, gonna be your escort, Marta? You go with your cousin, Octavio. What? He can't even dance. Marta, he's just at an age where he's a little clumsy. He's a wart. Everybody's gonna laugh at me. He can hardly speak English. Hey, since when are you ashamed of your language? You will go with Octavio, or not at all. Great. The party hasn't even started, and it's already ruined. If she doesn't want her party, can I get a skateboard? <laughs> yeah. Portrell is kicking himself. His bid was over by 15%. The Salvo can't believe our operation. I gotta hand it to you, Montoya. You put it over. Mm. Welcome to the executive suite. What do you think? Not bad. Arturo, you're an asset to the company. Thank you, sir. And maybe now I can finally get to meet the family, huh? Of course, Mr. Waterman. It would be our honor. Well, the first thing we need is to figure out how to pull off that miracle we promised. Don't worry about that, sir. Miracles are easy. The hard part is uh, getting them shipped. Don't remind me. Congratulations, Mr. Operations Manager. <laughs> Gracias, Oscar. You deserve this job, too, you know. Not all American enough. No problem. No ganaste. <laughs> Look at him. A few months ago, they were staging raids, the Migra. Now they're in the education business. Since the new amnesty law, immigration is coming down hard on bosses who hire illegals. Everyone's nervous, and everyone's checking papers.
Would you hold still? How do you expect near Madina to do all this with you squirming around like a little monkey? <laughs> Look at this one. It has shiny beads all around the top. Yeah, each one like a diamond. And twice as expensive. Oh, Martita, maybe we should pick something a little more simple, huh? No, you should see what the girls are wearing now. It's not like in our day. I didn't have a day. And mi pueblo? By the time I looked up from the pigs and the chickens and the washing, your mama's day came and went. Se fue. <laughs> My daughter's gonna have something better. Huh? Mi abuelita made me such a gown. Mm -hmm. And I wore high heels for the first time. I almost walked off the inside of my skirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I look good. <laughs> Did mama tell you I have to go with Octavio? You should have seen the cousin I had to go with. Next to him, Octavio looks like Julio Iglesias. <laughs> <laughs> but cousins are safe, you know? It's like they're spies for the father. Mama. Mija, after you turn 15, you can make some of your own decisions. Yeah, but until then, it's Octavio. Ooh. The quinceañera party is only a celebration. Your true passage into womanhood must be earned. Now, how do you earn that passage? Through service to others. And you are all very fortunate, because that opportunity exists right now. This is a special time. Historic time. La amnestia, amnesty. As our religion says, forgiveness. Our church has set up an office to help people file amnesty applications. We need volunteers. Girls? Marta? Will you be of service? Will you be part of this forgiveness? of immigrants live in this country illegally. The amnesty program started last year is their chance to come forward and be pardoned without punishment for having lived outside the law until now. In time, those who qualify will become residents and eventually United States citizens. For the hours that you are here, you are being trusted with people's lives. Misplace an application form or forget to attach a money order and that person is as good as gone. Now, Application form here, medical exam, receipts and verification, photo here. We have exactly four weeks left, 28 days. Every hour counts. Any questions? Martha, the phone. Hello? They let children handle these matters. Puppy, we're not children. And besides, these people need our help. Yeah, but some of these people have been waiting a long time for a chance like this. Too long. You remember how it was. If you didn't like it here, you could go back. Are you through? And it's not a simple decision, either. In Mexico, things are easier. The life is not so fast. Oh, Samuel, you just remember it that way. No, oh, the air is warm. The people are warm. The sky is blue, the earth is rich. Now, in America, a man can always improve. Yes, he can move up. But in Mexico, a man can take time for his friends, for his family. Papi, please, can I be excused? I have to meet my girlfriends at the carnival. Aren't you going to help your mother? Mommy, please. Go. Papi. Me too. I have some homework to do. Homework? You're only in the first grade. Well, sort of like coloring. <laughs> Get out of here. Guess it's just you and me, buddy. Yeah. Pop, tell me about the horses in Mexico. I don't remember about any horses. Yeah, you know, the one that threw you off? Me? Yeah. <laughs> Never. That yegua stood six feet tall, me. I could see in her eyes she would not be broken. I rode her for three and a half hours, Miko. And we fell in love. I 
I walked in and he was kissing her. I mean, really kissing her. Their lips were together like crazy glue. You wondered how they could even breathe. They can't. When people kiss, they can suffocate. Then what happened? The commercial came on and I had to help my mom fix dinner. Oh, oh Shady. Well, I won't be home to watch tomorrow because I'm going on a date with Billy Berto. A real date? Aren't you scared? Scared of what? He's already kissed me. <gasps> oh. I have no fears, but it's just all over my shoes. Gabby, wait, don't move. You have a big black bug right in your eye. A bug? That's not a bug, that's not scary. <laughs> Cover up. <laughs> Gorgeous cousin of Gabby's. Is he gonna stay around? Oh, he just sort of popped up. No plans, no suitcase, and no manner. Aren't you gonna introduce us? It's only polite. Todos los enamorados. Ramón. Una buena música de salsa. These are my very good friends, Jackie, Lupi, and Marta. What's up? You remember Marta? You danced with her at Gabby's quince? Yes, I, I remember her. Well, aren't you going to ask her to dance now? Did you bring your father with you this time? No. How to dance. On the top of my father's shoes and you? Hey, everybody's good at something. This is all I know how to do. So I hear you're from New York? PR. What? Puerto Rico. And, and now you live here with your aunt or something? Hey, look, let me tell you something. I've been taking care of myself since I was 14, all right? 14? That's my age. <laughs> Who's Richard Stans? Who? Richard Stans. One of your little friends at school? No. In the morning when we say the Pledge of Allegiance, you say, and to the Republic, for Richard Stans. Richard Stans? Well, he must be one of the... There's no Richard Stans, stupid. It's, it's to the Republic for which it stands. Hmm. That's an easy mistake. And don't call your brother stupid. Hey, Pop, wanna help me with my stamp collection? I'm gonna go for a walk. Stay, I'll take you home in my car, all right? All right, all right, all of you. It's a deal. We don't. What we gotta do is just all squeeze in together. <laughs> Martha, isn't that your dad? Puppy, what are you doing? I was out for a walk. It's getting late. I thought it'd be a good idea to uh, walk you home. See you guys tomorrow. Good night, Mr. Delacruz. Good night, Mr. Delacruz. 
Good night, girls. What were you girls doing with that boy? He's just Gabby's cousin. How old is he anyway? I think he's too old, Mika. I think you're too young. I'm not too young, puppy. Other girls my age are already dating. That's enough. Don Samuel! ¿Cómo le va? Ah, no muy bien. ¿Qué pasa? I look for work, but they ask me for paper. So I buy false card. It's no good. The boss, he no take it. 